Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today I will be unboxing ATBO's debut mini album, The Beginning. Uh, this is IST Entertainment's new boy group after The Boys. Um, this is The Boys' new junior group, so I'm so excited because ATBO is like quickly becoming one of my faves. I think their music is amazing and I love all the members. I watched the survival show they were made on, which was The Origin, AB or What. So yeah, I got these albums off of, well I got them from two sites. I got eight albums from K-Town For You, so four of the polychrome and four of the monochrome versions. And then I also got two um, extra copies from Aladdin and I also got the platform version from Aladdin. So yeah, but first before we go into these, um, K-Town For You did pubs. So here I got the full pub set. So, uh, sorry for my hands, I just came back from work, so they look fucking disgusting, but yeah, so here's Junsuk, and the backs are all the same, they just look like this. There's Junmin, Hyunjun, Hyunjun's my bias, so yes, I will be collecting all of his cards. We have Rakwon, Sungwon, Yongkyu. And one bin. And then since I bought eight albums, I came with one extra one bin pop. So yeah, I got the full set of pops. Thank God. K, K Town for You actually did something right. So yeah, let's get into the. We're gonna do the monochrome version first. All right, so let's do the monochrome version first. So I already took out all the inclusions. They were actually all in this pouch, which I didn't think there was. So hopefully none of the cards are like damaged from that. But yeah, here is the CD. Just a plain monochrome look as they're going for. So yeah, I'm super excited for ATBO's debut. And if I say Atbo, I'm so sorry. I just have a habit of saying that because it's easier. But yeah, here are the members. I love the contrasting concepts. I love the uh, polychrome version concepts better. But I do love a good suit moment. That looks so good. Here's Young Q. I'm so proud of him from going from treasure box to here. He literally deserved it so much. Our main vocal king. And I don't know if anyone's talked about this. I'm sure people have, but um, I don't know about on YouTube because I don't see too many ATBO collectors. But Young Q is giving new teas. Choi Chenny from The Boys. He's giving that. Regiment. You literally do everything. Oh, Junsuk. I'm talking about doing everything. Junsuk is literally the ace. He raps, uh, sings, dances, everything. He's literally perfection. Wonbin. I'm gonna be honest, I'm not as attached to Wonbin because he was like eliminated so early in the survival show, but. Um, through watching their walk shop, that little variety thing after debut, I'm getting to see his personality more, and he's so sweet. Here we have the other three. Oh my god. I'm sorry for the glare. It's just the way my light works. Yeah, dude! Oh my god, I'm so beyond happy he made it. He was my pick from day one, and I'm literally so proud of him. At all the balancers were against him. Sungyu, JB, I'm looking at y'all. Minzy's the only one who had my boy's back. It was someone. Literally Hyunjae's child. Look at him. Hyunjae's younger brother. Sokrak Won. I love his voice. His voice is so good. Group pictures. God, Hyunjun! Look at him! Are we kidding? Oh, this is a nice size photo book for a debut. Love that. So now that we're talking the debut, let's get into the songs. Um, I think. Well, I, know, I think I know my favorite song on the album is Graffiti. That is literally their best B side. I know this is their first album, but their best B side. Uh, I really like the title. At first, I was like, okay, like 
it's kind of noise, but it's kind of good noise. You know what I mean? But yeah, monochrome color is really good. Um, my other favorite B-side is High Five. From the highlight medley, I knew I was going to like it. And then, of course, I love Run because that was the signal song they had from the survival show. So yeah, here's the things. <laughs> Don't kill my vibe, we're not monochrome. Okay, LGBTs, I see y'all. Monochrome, graffiti, high five, wow, and run. The credits. So yeah, all the inclusions were in here, so let's get into that. Oh yeah, there's the back. Did I show this? Here's what it looks like. Cool. Okay, so all the photo cards are underneath, but let's go through these first. So here are the stickers for the monochrome version. Oh yeah, that's their phantom name. It's Boat. I think it's really cute. At first I was like, Boat? They're gonna call us Boats? But yeah, I kind of dig it. That. And then next is this. I think it's, oh, it's a printed photo. It's a random member. One, two, three. We got Yonkyu! Oh my god. Slay. He's a slayer, for real. That. And next is a standee. We've got Jinmin. God, he looks so good. Okay. And now there's three photo cards in here. So let's see. Let's go through this one first because it doesn't have anything on the back. Okay. One, two, three. Oh, we got someone. Is this limited? I think this might be the monochrome limited PC. I'm not too sure. Because there is two actual photo cards and then there's a limited PC if you want these first press, which I did. Cool. So there's someone. Monochrome limited. And then let's go through the photo cards. They're really flimsy. They're like really thin, but one, two, three. We got Hyunjun! Oh my god, yes. Thank god. We got at least one Hyunjun card, hoping that this isn't the last one. There's his sig. Very cute. Yay. We got Hyunjun. Okay. And last card. Did you all see it? I didn't see it, but one, two, three. We got someone again! Yes! We love best friends. Literally. Beihuan. Unbeatable. Yay! Okay, so that was the first copy of Monochrome. Alright, next let's do the Polychrome version. They had two versions of the album. This one's the more, like, bright concept. It was giving very much the boys thrill ride. So here's the CD. Very, very yellow theme. outfits the fits are questionable but i still think they look good yeah to me hyunjun's in particular very was giving very much thrill ride and i live for it jun Sook's hat not really living for that jun Sook and rock one yeah i don't know what this is I don't really like that. Yeah, I'm not a fashion girl, but that's not really giving what I want it to give. I think he looks kind of funny, kind of silly. He's in a goofy, silly mood, so I guess we'll excuse it. We have Rock One. Hey, Supreme Hat. Ice Tea got money? Not really. Y'all didn't know his nickname is Cheeseball. Look at him. Oh my god. Literally cheesing. Deserves the world. Oh god. How do we go from this to this? Like, sir, what? What? Okay. One bin. Okay. The outfit's kind of camp. I kind of like it. This? No. I don't like that. Is he wearing it there? Oh, you didn't really see it, but I don't like that. It's not giving. Oh my god, it's layers. Hyunjun! Little, little, that's nephew. That's nephew right there. Oh my god. 
the vans You're just, is that, those are vans right yeah i was gonna say i have those exact shoes oh my god this, this picture slay okay i'm gonna have to scan this i love this picture Jinmin. the hair love oh my god he's cunty and he knows it thank you I like the colors. I really like the colors. These, this album is like making me like yellow more, which I didn't think was possible. But yeah, I kind of like this. Okay, the yellow and the purple, it's giving very much Lakers, Los Angeles Lakers. God, if they give us purple outfits instead, that'd be awesome. I love that. But if they're dipping with like a color kind of concept, I wonder if they're gonna keep this up. Like, they mentioned, like, the colors, like, vermilion and, like, I can't remember the other colors, I'm so stupid, but they mentioned, like, different colors in their debut song, so that'd be, like, kind of slay if they kept up colors for all their albums and, like, did different colors for each one. I'd love that. I love seeing cohesion with album designs. Plus, you can never go wrong with a good book packaging. I love the book package style. But yeah, that was the polychrome version. I already took the inclusions out, so let's see those. All right, first is the stickers. So this is what they look like. I'm not gonna lie, I kind of like the black and white ones more, but I still probably will use that one. I like that one. Next, okay, next is the printed photo. Let's put it down. Okay, one, two, three. We got one bin. Sly, love him. Next is the, um, oh my god, I'm blanking. Standy. Okay, one, two, three. Look at Young Q with his beret. Is that a beret? I don't know. Unpopular opinion, but I fucking hate berets. I don't, I don't think they're cute. Next. Okay, let's get this one. This one doesn't have a sick on the back. So this is the limited one. Okay, one, two, three. We got Young Q. Oh my god. Love that. It looks so good. Next is the one of the versions. I don't know which one's photo card A, which one's B, but one, two, three. We got one bin with his cheek heart. Cute. Oh, there's a sig. Very simple sig, but I love it. Okay, last card. Ready? Oh, you can see it. Oh, I can see it. That's the one. Ready? One, two, three. Yee, cute. Okay, I like the green fits more. I like the green fits. They're like wearing them for their debut stage and on the music video. So yeah, that was it for the polychrome. Now let's go through the platform version. All right, so here's the platform version. And um, I don't know if many of you have seen this, but a lot of groups are doing these platform versions where it's literally just like two photo cards, like doesn't have any like other, like no CD, no big packaging. I think it's like to save the environment or whatever. Kind of like that. Um, so yeah, anything to help the environment, but these are cheaper, so it's good for our wallets. But yeah, right when I right when I open it, I'm sure the photo cards are right there, so let's just open and see. Ready? Oh, there's all my names. Ready? One, two, three. Oh my god! Okay. Oh, there is some other inclusion, but let's see. We got one bin's actual photo card for the platform version. Cute. And then we got Young Q's PVC photo card for the platform version. Is it focused? I hope so. Oh, well, I might blur that out. I don't know. If I do, you'll probably see a picture of like Kanji or something, but yeah. There's Young Q. And then the other thing you get in here is a little postcard. That's cute. Cool. So yeah, not much in that one. So now I will just be going through all my other album pulls for the, I bought like eight other copies for K-Town For You. Two of them are going to another joiner because I hosted a group order, but it flopped. So yeah, I just have eight albums for my, or 
six albums for myself, two for a group or a genre. So yeah, let's go through those. I'm just gonna like speed through them really quick just to see the pools. I got new poles. Oh my god. Oh my god. I got a real Polaroid. Oh my god. I got a real Polaroid. You're joking. Oh my god. Ah! Oh my god. I'm literally. What? What? Oh my god. I got a real Polaroid. Oh my god. <laughs> what i wasn't even like thinking i literally saw the photo cards and i was like wait what is that that doesn't look like an inclu inclusion in this album but i literally got a polaroid ah, oh my god you're literally joking you're literally joking i'm probably gonna blur this out but you're joking what? Oh my god. Oh my god. Alright, so that was my unboxing for ATBO's The Beginning, their debut album. Yeah, a lot of photo cards, probably the most I've ever had. And if you hear my air conditioning, I'm so sorry, but yeah, that marks the end of this unboxing. I think my next unboxing will probably be uh, either Girls' Generation's comeback with Forever One or The Boys' comeback with Be Aware. So yeah, look up for that. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.